Hi, my name is Max, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to set up your own TCL Ray Neo developer account and get started using the AI Studio to make your own AI agents. AI agents made in the Ray Neo AI Studio are optimized to address specialized tasks in the Ray Neo X2 AR smart glasses. Think of AI agents in the Ray Neo X2 smart glasses as like having a bunch of different experts that can do different things based on what they're looking at and hearing and what you're asking them to do through these glasses. These AI agents can be made easily because the Ray Neo AI Studio has a simple setup to give your agents a description, instructions for your agents to follow, a knowledge category where you can upload files to be read offline by your agent, an actions category where you can give specific tasks for your agent to follow, such as scraping a website for information, and the agents are capable of image recognition as a standard. That means when your agents are deployed to the glasses, you can just take a simple picture for your agent to recognize things in the image. Let's get started with setting up a Rayneo developer account and getting familiar with the Rayneo AI Studio. Then we'll make an AI agent together. Let's start with the open platform registration and registration form filling process. Begin at open.rayneo.com and sign up for an account. You will receive an email and need to click on the link in the email to get set up. From there, you can log in. Next, you need to complete the information and identity authentication to enter the console. You can choose between personal authentication and enterprise authentication. After submitting the authentication information, you can directly enter the console to complete the permission application for AI Studio. Go to the TCL Ray Neo Discord and go to the How to Participate channel in the AI Challenge channel. Here you can find the AI Agent Enrollment Form link in the AI Agents Track post. You must use the same email that you used when registering on the open platform. Before submitting this form, the permission application for AI Studio must be completed. Permissions are generally completed within three working days, and you'll be notified by email. Three days later. At this point, you should have access to the Rayneo AI Studio, so go back to the open.rayneo.com webpage and click on console at the top. There you will find the Rayneo AI Studio. Click on Create AI Agent. This is where you can choose the app icon, a name for your AI agent, the description for what your AI agent is and what it does, and the instructions field. The instructions are probably the most important part because this tells GPT-4V what it should do and what it should not do. After that, there is a knowledge field where you can upload files to be read by the Rayneo AI agent. And this can be especially helpful because these files might not be accessible by normal GPT-4V. Or if you're using this for work-related stuff, you can have it for your company's files so that the AI agent can directly read your company's files and use it to your benefit. Probably the most interesting area of the Rayneo AI Studio is the tools. Here you can add actions. Actions are a way of integrating simple code that can have GPT-4B access different websites and get different information to be used by your AI agent. In this example, we see a weather.example.com where you get the weather data from any city. On the right side of the screen is where you can test your AI agent. Here is a quick AI agent I fabricated. I actually used ChatGPT to help me write the description and the instructions for this agent so that I would spend less time testing it in the AI Studio. The AI Studio only has a certain number of tokens and I don't want to run out of tokens before I've finished testing. This agent is called PraisePal. 
PraisePal works by when you take a picture, it gives a compliment. If you take a picture of a friend or a random person, it will compliment that person. If you take a picture of a table, it will compliment that table. It will compliment anything. While testing in Rayneo AI Studio, it's worth noting that images uploaded need to be controlled to less than one megapixel for optimal use. Here is a video shared by the Rayneo development team on what AI agents may look like in action. At this point, you know how to get access to the open platform and develop your own AI agents once you get admitted. Join our TCL Rayneo developer discord to stay engaged with our daily updates and breakthroughs. Thanks for watching.